Hello everybody and welcome to this very very special video. First of all, I'd like to wish you all a happy New Year's Eve. I hope you guys are having a great day. My name is Jess Branker and I'm joined by Bob Boston. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Okay, so what we're going to do guys is we're going to release our new project which is cyclingup.tv. I know you guys have been wondering what is cycling up doing in their spare time for the last three months we haven't heard anything from them. Well this is it guys. We have made cyclingup.tv so you can go on there right now and get your the daily doses of cycling. Oh you see what I did there? See what I did there. Okay. So uh Bob Austin, Bob, why don't you run us through just the front page real quick? What can you see on the front page? Well, on the front page, you're getting the videos that are coming up. So as you can see, you get your weekly rants are the latest stuff. You have the um, read more. So if, if these were uh, other videos, you could obviously get the articles. You have your front page. You have all your site, your, your sections of the site on the top. Uh, you have your daily doses of cycling. And then if you scroll down a bit, you get uh, Vuelta because those are some of the important summaries and videos that have been done recently. Races are on the side. You got your uh, social media handles all there. Exactly. If, let's say you want to, I want to know more about the 21st stage of the World Test Planet. You just press read more, you go to a separate page on the website, and right here, you get on here, you see the video, you see the, uh, the YouTube video player, right on the left side, on the right side, you see the playlist, this, if you press another link, it links to another page on the website, which leads to that race. Underneath, you have the summary, I'm not sure who... Uh, we have three writers on this team. We've got Julian Chu, which you probably, if you're following the, the cycling of Jesper Anchor, is a commentator. You've got Bob Bobson, my co-commentator in this call right now. And we've got a separate guy called Henrik van Betts. These three guys are going to be writing articles or summaries throughout the year and also have interviews with specific writers. So it's going to be very good. Not sure who wrote this one. Was it I think you? It was, I believe it was uh, Julian Chu. Yeah, I believe it was as well. So you can go on here. You can read the, uh, the summaries of the race. This was a time trial, so not much to read. If you scroll further down, you can download the video i know we've gotten questions in the past about can we please download the video and upload it for our own purposes like you need it for a school project well now you can you just press the download this video button and you go straight to the download button underneath that you get the race results and you get that as far down as possible so you don't get spoiled and i think that's a good thing because in the past we have spoiled the results in since uh, thumbnails in comment sections and so on it's not something we're proud of but it does happen Next up, we've got the video sections. Why don't you run us through? What can you see in the video section, Bob? Well, as it says, there's all 135 videos. You just get the latest. The latest videos are right there underneath. And as you can see, those are weekly rants at this point because it's not the cycling season. Exactly. Um, so, but you would get you would get all your videos right there, and you're gonna um, you're just gonna be able to get all of them nice and easy. You can search them in the search. And that'll bring up whatever you want. So if you're looking sp for a specific stage or a specific rant, just uh, search I'm searching one, right one right now. I'm searching a Walter, Walter Stage One. Oh, sorry, you have to put. So it's still a, there's still a mistake. You have to search it in the right order. So let's say you cannot write Vuelta España. You have to write Vuelta a España because if you have it in the wrong order, it's not gonna show up. So if you search Vuelta Stage One, it's not gonna show up correctly. So you see here, I wrote in Vuelta, and it finds two races. It finds Vuelta Burgos and Vuelta España. We're currently working on something called an infinity loader. If you've been on 9gag, been on Facebook, or been on YouTube, you know when you scroll down, it loads more videos or races or pictures or something like that. We're working on getting that on this side because with the, the high amount of videos, it's going to increase the amount of loading time. And we're trying to decrease that as much as possible by getting an infinity loader on here. If you don't know what that term is, Google it and you'll get more information. Next up, we have another tab called Forum. And it's something we're very proud to uh, show you guys this year because if... You're ever thinking, I have so much knowledge, I have so much information, and so many opinions, like my good friend right here, Bob. You have a place to put those opinions into place. We go on the on the forum right here, cycling.tv slash forum. You go on here, you can make a uh, an account, you can register an account on the right side. Uh, you can discuss things, like right now, the send is to an under. I see, I see G. Hardy just posted something, he says, but Saviva's also coming, he's probably a favorite. G. Hardy right there. Is joining the conversation. He's saying what he thinks is going to win or who he thinks is going to win. 
So you guys are wondering, what is in this census tour done under threat? Well, you see here, you've got the stage name, where it's from, where it's to, how long it is, which day it is. You see the stage profile. You see our favorites. You see who the tipsters bet on. These tipsters are uh, the cycling mole on Twitter. It's pa uh, Pat's bets. These guys who also who all go 100k plus a year on cycling bets. So you should probably follow these guys. Very smart of you. But basically, just join the conversation on here. Many things to watch on the forum. You, there's also uh, uh, news threads you can go on here, as you see, news in January. So if you have any news you want to give out to us, like cycling related, go right on here, and we would like to hear that. Is there anything else you'd like to add to the forum BBL that makes it amazing? Just that you can literally express anything you want on here. We have a there's there's a forum thread for every race, and it's you can give your own predictions and you can discuss what happens afterwards. The conversation never stops as long as you guys create it and. Uh, that's that's the great thing about a forum. It's very true. And if you want to go back to the main site, you just press main site, the navigation bar on the left side. Then we get back to the main site. It's going to take a while because there are a bit, a bit of things to load, and that's why we're working on the Infinity Loader. Next up, I'm not going to press on the weekly rant because that page does not have the Infinity Loader yet. And as you see down here, we have 48 episodes of the weekly rant. And, Bob, I don't think we explained what is the weekly rant yet. Would you like to explain that? The Weekly Rant is basically a show we've done for the past year, every Sunday, where we just talk about all the events, races, news, and rumors of the cycling season with um, Jesper, Julian, and myself. And we just, we can rant about anything. Sometimes we have differing opinions, that's, that's the great thing of it, sometimes we agree, and you can really just get all the thought processes on... Certain debates, certain topics, certain races, and whatever's going on in that past week. Exactly, and you're going to see a tweet of the week, you're going to see videos, you're going to see cycling-related content as well on there. So, anything out there for your cycling addiction. Next up, well, we got the countdown to the release. Technically, the site is still not uh, released at this exact moment. You see it's 6 o'clock my time. So, there's still 5 hours until we actually release the site. But when you see this, the site has been officially released. So, uh, Happy New Year's! Uh, <laughs> Other than that, there's also races in the right-hand corner. If you're just looking for a specific race, you can go on here, you can find it. You do see the weekly rant, but that's because we need a category to put it in to get it like the other races. So that's why you see it there. But just go on here, search it up, all 22 races. It's pretty good, guys. So that is our website. I am very proud to be doing this. If you have any wishes you want us to be see on the cycle, if you have like, or have a brilliant idea, what about a live chat on the forum? Well, you go on the forum, you go to the discussion forum, you go down in the cycling hub category, you go on cycling hub wishlist, and you create a new thread. If you have an idea, shoot it right our way, and our IT guy Kenneth will go straight ahead and working on it. But Bob, do you have anything to say before we leave it hanging? Enjoy the forum and enjoy the site, and I hope you guys really like uh, everything that's been done. Basically what he just said, and I wish you guys a happy new year. Thank you guys for watching, no matter if you're watching on Cyclone Jesper Anchor, Cyclone 14, Cyclone 15, or Pro-Am Kia. Thank you guys very much, and see you guys in the new year.